Hello everybody, welcome back to another Let's Play, episode 1 of Belheim, brand new series. I'm just going to jump right in with character creation here. That works. Call myself the Mighty Boothar. <gasps> no. Okay, just Mighty Boothar. Alright here. Uh, create a new world. I can't do special characters, lovely. Alright, done. And... Got up in a new world. Alright, uh, let's go and talk to you. Welcome to the 10th World Warrior. I am Hagen, Hugen, sent here to guide you in your travels. The megaliths surrounding you are the sacrificial stones. They represent the Forsaken, which you must slay in order to ascend to Valhalla. Oh, well, thank you. All right. Oh, it's you again. This stone is... I'm going to butcher that awfully. Vegvisa. These magical stones are scattered throughout the lands by Odin as signposts pointing towards the ritual grounds of the Forsaken. If inspected closer, this one will reveal the summoning place of... Uh, Ikthe. Probably butchered that one as well. Your first prey. He is a mighty beast, so you need to be pro you need to properly arm yourself before attempting to defeat him. Oh, thank you. Oh, that's really close. Sweet. That is very close. There's a, a deer over there. Actually, no, no I'm going to go this way because there's coast here. I'm going to try and get some materials quickly and some food that would be a great start yes hello a tasty morsel you have found a snack consume it to improve your health and stamina be aware that before long you will go hungry again so try to always have at least a couple of different meals ready thank you some shrooms gotta have some shrooms a dandelion. Hell yeah. There's a boar over there. I'm just gonna go away from that because I don't really feel like being attacked right this second. Grab some more berries. And then I want to try and find some more resources. Move down to this coastline. Some stones over there. Oh, and some more shrooms. Okay. Uh, grab some resources down here. So there's flint, which would be handy. And some stones as well. Okay, I think I'll try to build, like, around that area, to, like, to start. So that I'm, like, somewhat close to the... First boss. But not close enough to where my base will get destroyed when I fight it. Okay, you know what? I'll make a hammer for now. Uh, I can't quite use it, so I just need wood. Really? Yeah, I just need wood. What do you have to see now? Take stock of your inventory. More items must be crafted. How, well, most items must be crafted. However, due to your recent departure from Midgard, you'll have to recall the shape of objects. Just pick up things, and it'll all come back to you, I'm sure. My lesser brother, Mun Munum, tells me one can fashion a stone axe out of wooden stone. Thank you. I should pick up all these branches, and then I should be good to go. Uh, I'll go talk to him again quickly as well. Oh, he bids Titans. Thank you. What do you have to say now? You have crafted a hammer. With this tool, you will raise mighty halls and towering for uh, fortifications. I almost said a very wrong word there. Um, start by building a workbench. This in turn will enable you to construct other things. I, um, I almost like mispronounced that. 
and uh, terror and fornications would not have been good. Uh, how much do I have? Fine, I need one more for the axe. And then I can just make the club after that. Because I can cut down some trees. There's one right over there. Oh, there's a building here. And a grey lane. Okay, let me just... Do that. Beat this guy up. Real quick. There we go. I'll pick up this stuff. I thank you. I can craft the torch now. Okay, let me get the stamina back. Thank you. Can I go up here? There is nothing here. Awesome. Alright, actually, I can make a axe now. I'll make that. And then after this, I'll be able to craft the club. And then not get crushed by that. It's never fun. Hopefully soon. There we go. There we go. Sweet. Alright, I'll make me a club now. Sweet. And then... Oh, there's some stuff over there. There's also something over there. I'll go have a look at that in a second. You know what, actually, I'm gonna... I'm gonna eat that so I can have some stamina. Yeah, alright, sweet. Oh, there's some resources there. Always on that grind. There's two stones on top of each other. <laughs> Alright, what is this? Oh, sweet. There's a chest here. Uh, no, I want all of that. Thank you. I reckon I could pick the chest up. Oh, I need a crafting station. Oh well. Let me head over here. This balls here. Actually, no, that's not a bad thing. I'd be very okay if they came and attacked me. Preferably just attack and not kill. What are you doing, sir? Thank you. There's another one here. I could have should have snuck up on it. Oh, it's just dead now. Sweet, and some more berries. Awesome. A lot of berries. Very nice. Alright. Is this anything? No, I don't think it is. That's fine. Another build in here though. Is there another chest in this one? I didn't see one. Oh, there's one. There's a uh, railing. Sweet. And then some berries. Actually, I'll grab these quick first. And then I'll go grab that chest. And then I'm going to go and make... Or we'll start, like... Trying to get somewhere... Like, camp down. Can I reach that chest from here? I can't. Let me get my stamina back, maybe. There we go. Sweet. Alright. Uh, yeah, let me go up to that area by the boss and see what I can do about a base for now. A little campsite. But it's not such a terrible area. Oh, hello there. Calling forth the beast. You have found the summoning place of one of the Forsaken. Make the correct offering at the altar and they will come. Be wary though, the Forsaken are not easy prey, so craft a wicked weapon. Craft a wicked weapon. Sorry. Add. Don your finest armor and eat a hearty meal before engaging them in combat. I thank you. I'm assuming this tells me what I need to sacrifice. Hunter's kin. 
Okay, so Diz. That's fine. Uh, ooh, this is much better place. Alright. I can work with this. Let me grab these and then I get a work bench down somewhere. I should have enough, but I think it's 10 wood. Yeah, I should have enough wood. Better idea. To start with, I'll go see what this is like over here. Because I know there was a... I did see a house in the woods here. Oh, there is a deer there. Maybe I can sneak up on him. Oh, that did not do anywhere near enough damage. Oh well. Alright, kill this grayling quickly. Sweet, and then I'll see what this house is like, because I could just rebuild this, to be honest. Is there a beehive in it? There is a beehive in it. Great. Um. Okay. You know what? That's not, like, a bad... Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll work with it. I'll work with it. Alright. Okay. Take out these trees that are inside the building. Alright, and then... Uh, and on the eight... Crafting, workbench. Let me just stick you right in this corner for now. Thank you. Okay. No, no, I want to pick that one. That's the one. Hello there. Uh, you have built a workbench. The workbench allows you to craft complex items as well as giving you access to a lot more building pieces to construct with a hammer. Thank you. Alright, I need to... Now then, that was the wrong button. The very, very wrong button. It... It's that. I just need to click them. <laughs> Oops. Alright, it's fine. Let me just repair all of this stuff. I forget it takes stamina to repair things. Alright, and then let me just repair that. Sweet, alright, and then I'm gonna just uh, remove those and destroy that. Sweet. And then gonna be some honey too. Alright, then just repair that. Uh, get to rebuilding it, I guess. Okay, got that. That one there, and then let's get the floor down. You should just snap nicely. Sweet. Okay, and that one is already there. Okay, what do I need now? Oh, I haven't uh, repaired you. Oh, actually, that reminds me. Let me go out of this. I need to build a roof on it first. Right, let me do that. Uh, which one is this one? I'm pretty sure. Uh, it is not that one. Okay, this one. There we go. Oh, I don't have any wood. All right, that's fine. Um, I gotta get some wood now. Quickly, let me just repair everything. Sweet, get that stuff. Uh, I need to cut down another tree in a second, but I'll just get this done now quickly. Eight, put you nicely over there. And then nicely across here. Okay. Uh, I'm assuming this is walls all along here. Oh, 
Oh, no, up the top, please. Thank you. And then, just like that. I'll go and deal with that in just a second. Three. Where are you? I, I, I thought that was footsteps behind me, but it was just blood. Can you, like, not run away from me, please? Alright, thank you. I will go and talk to the said bird quickly. Be wary of the weather. When the temperature drops at night, or if you are wet, you will suffer from being cold. This reduces your stamina regeneration. Seeking shelter by an open flame is your best option when this happens. Cool. I need to... First, how much? Not enough wood. Alright, let me cut down one more tree again. And then I just need to get that roof on the top. And then I need to build a little section at the back by that window there. So there's just going to be a little chimney going up there. Oh, it's fine. I can block that up. I should both block it up. Mm, that one will do. There we go. Alright, now then I need to go this side. Up the back here and just... Actually, a floor is probably a good idea first. Okay, there we go. Get a campfire. Why can't I place a campfire there? Oh, okay, it can't be on the floor. Alright, yeah, that's fine then. I'll break that. Why can't I snap the wall onto that then? Okay, there we go, there we go. Okay. Uh, let me get the campfire in there now, quickly. Okay. And then get that wall on there. And then just build this up a little bit. Okay, um, I guess I'll have to do it one more time, won't I? Unless, actually, uh, let me go in half walls over there, and can I get that up there? Over there, and then just put a, a roof on top of that. I can't really get that to snap, that's the only thing. There we go. Alright. I think that's good. Hopefully. Is that good? If I stand here, am I gonna start choking? No, we're good. Okay. Sweet. Uh, I need to get more wood quickly to make a bed. And... Actually, you know what? That's okay. I'm gonna make a bed, a chopping block, a cooking station, and a chest. So that's 10, 18... Uh, 28, 38, 40. So I need 40. Alright, that's not too bad. Alright, uh, how much wood is that? Uh, 40. Sweet. Okay, let's go. 43 actually, which means I have some from the campfire as well. So I can make some food quickly. But let's uh, start with the bed. Let's just chuck this down right over there. Okay, get the chest down. 
over there. And then I can just put that in there for now. And then cooking station needs to be over the campfire. That should be good enough. And then outside I will make the beehive quickly. Oh, okay. Thank you, game. Okay, I'll just put the beehive there for now. And then I need to cook me some food. Let me talk to you first. A headrest for the weary. Sleep the night away in your bed and awaken feeling refreshed and full of energy. Another improvement to your home would be some chests where you can store items. It's a good practice to always have spare equipment. If something unfortunate should happen while you're exploring. Oh, but thank you. Let me, let me cook some food. And then pop, uh, if I can reach it. There we go. Fill the campfire a little bit. How much more meat do I have? Okay, I can just cook these three. There we go. All right. I was just being impatient. Let me cook that last one. And then I have a decent start on food, actually. I've got mushrooms, uh, raspberries, boar meat, and then also honey, which is now a, like, constant thing. Ah, uh, it smoked itself out. Okay, yeah, that's fine. I thought I didn't make this properly. Let me do that. Yeah, I thought I didn't make that properly. Oh well, that should be fine now. I don't want to burn my boar meat there. Why, oh, thank you. Alright. Yeah. Okay, uh, let me chuck the stuff in here that I don't really need right this second. Uh, I can live on just raspberries for now. And then let me go in here. Because this is now one star, or two star, sorry. So I can make some more stuff. I want to get a bow. <clears throat> that would be a start. I need to kill more boars. And uh, get some more wood, which isn't a problem at all. Uh, then I need to make the rag tunics. I need to make the pants. And then, which is uh, just more balls as well. Some arrows. And then a flint head axe. And yeah, flint head axe is the next one. Okay, that's not too bad at all. And I can upgrade stuff as well. Alright. I'm going to make a flint head axe really quickly. By clearing... How much do I need? I need four, so this could be... Like, oh, let me not do that. Sweet. Right. Flint axe. Craft. Awesome. And then I can upgrade it, but I'm going to save that for now. And then just chuck all the rest of this in the chest. Sweet. Alright. Uh, let me claim you. Alright. I think that was a pretty good start. We have a, a house made with a bed and whatnot. Let me mark that on the map. Oh no, it's marked as a bed. Actually, no, I'll just put another one on there just to be safe and call it home. Alright. Yeah, that seems like a decent start for now. Got a bed, a house, workbench down, some food, a renewable food source as well with the beehives. Pretty, pretty good start. So I'm gonna call it there then. I uh, hope you, really hope you guys enjoyed this one. And uh, I'll see you in the next one. Bye!